internet, it's the end of 2012, which means a lot of people are going through with their favorite things of the year, and today, co-hosting is my dad. Say hi. Hi. And we are going to go through some of the movies we've seen this year. I'm going to say the name of the movie, and then try to remember what it's about, and then we'll decide if it was good or not. All right. Okay, so The Avengers. The Avengers, that was great. It's the, the comic book heroes. Yeah. Okay, so that one was awesome. I give it two thumbs up. It was very good. And the 3D was good, too. Yes, very good. Big Miracle. Big Miracle. I remember that we saw it. I don't remember what it was. What it's was the, it? the whales. Oh, eh, it was all right. Okay, so this was based on the true story of three whales that got stuck in the ice up in, like, northern Alaska. It really happened back in the 80s, and it was a good, it was a good family movie. Yeah. Mirror, mirror. Yeah. I think I fell asleep during that one. He did. <laughs> this it was it was a really odd retelling of Snow White and it was just like why? They really didn't need to make that one. Brave. So this was in theaters this year. But I didn't see it. You didn't see that one? I didn't see it. Okay. Well So I can't talk about it. Oh, man. Well You can talk about it. It was pretty good. The animation was incredible. Argo. Excellent. So that, this was a, a true, based on a mm -hmm. true story of, about um, the hostages, a, a, a portion of the hostages in Iran mm -hmm. who managed to escape um, with the help of, of the Canadians. And it was a thrilling movie. Yay, Canada. It was a thrilling movie, and even though you knew how it was going to end, it kept you on the edge of the seat right till the very I end. I was in the theater, like, clutching both of the handles, being like, yeah. come on, come on. I actually can't wait to see that one again. I think that Argo definitely needs to be nominated for Best Picture. Yeah, I, think I was so blown too. away by that one. Okay. And I, I hear that, oh, there's a new one, a very much um, in the same vein. It's about the um, the end of the Bin Laden. Oh, Zero saga. Dark Thirty. Zero Dark Thirty. I saw a trailer for that when yeah. I went to see Lincoln last week. It's just, really good. It's just coming out, so we'll have to see how that yes. one compares. Skyfall. I like Skyfall. Skyfall is the new James Bond. I gushed a little bit about it, I think, last month. Yeah, it was it was interesting how they went back to a lot of um, things from the past. Yeah. Showed where he had grown up and some of the backstory. Mm -hmm. And I thought it was good that um, there was a lot of attention um, given to M. Yes, I don't think Dame Judi Dench could be any cooler if she wanted to. That was really good. Yeah, I, I enjoyed it. Arthur Christmas. Arthur Christmas was an animated family special mm -hmm. that we just saw. It was actually a movie from last Christmas. Yeah. But um, as a family, we really liked it. We had a good time. It's always been a motto in our family of, can you wrap a gift with three? Three bits of sticky tape, which was a running gag in the movie that yeah. I particularly enjoyed. Yeah, even though it was a, a family film. That was, was a really good family was, film. It was a very enjoyable movie. It happened one night. I don't even remember what that the was. The black and white movie? Clark Gable? Oh, that was, that was, <laughs> this one here likes one in a, a, an old film. It was made in 1934 with Clark Gable who was the guy from Gone with the Wind, and apparently, the biggest thing I got out of this movie is that in 1934, it was totally normal for people to just lie around in bed smoking, because he does this at least twice during this 90-minute movie. Yeah, it was okay. We laughed. It was... It was alright. It was fine. War Horse. We saw War Horse this War year. War Horse was... It was good. Mm -hmm. It was good. It's a film adaptation of a play. That was... That was Adapted from a book. book. Yeah. A children's book. That's why you should always read the book first if you can. So it was about a boy and his horse, and the horse ends up going all over Europe during World War One, and the boy is trying to find him. So it was it was a you know family film, cute. I really want to see the play. The Big Year. Oh, was this the bird movie? Yes. Yeah, it was. We'll it was actually one. surprisingly good. So yes. this was Steve Martin and Jack Black, Jack Black. and Owen Wilson. Yes, yes. Owen Wilson. And so they're bird watchers who, who go on a quest to see how many different birds they can see in North America within the time span of one year. Yeah. It's like an unofficial contest. And it sounds really kind of hokey, but it was, it was, so it was done really well. Yeah, yeah. Do you have anything to add? Is there anything I missed? No. I mean, um, I'm trying to think if there's anything but you've seen, seen in the theaters. theaters. 
I just saw Lincoln, which was really good. Yeah, I haven't seen it really yet. Really long. We're looking really forward good. to seeing Les Mis. Les Mis, it's yes. It's in the theaters now, but we haven't seen it yet. Yeah, those are our movie thoughts for 2012. All of my usual links are down below, under the dog. No. Oh. <laughs> in the leaky <laughs> bar. <laughs> and that's it from us for now, Internet. Take care. Bye-bye. That one, good. it better be nominated. Oh! <laughs> oh, great. <laughs>